Diabetes is one of the most devastating diseases in the world. Millions of people will die from the complications of diabetes. Even though we have many therapies, we have no cure. We believe that we have a new technology that produces a new approach to the treatment and potentially cure of type 1 and possibly even type 2 diabetes. Our group started out on a journey to try to understand the nature of the failure of the cell that produces insulin, which is the body's way of controlling glucose. The beta cell is a specialized cell in the pancreas of our body that is the sensor for sugar, and in response it releases insulin, which is the hormone that controls our sugar levels in our body. And that is essential for our normal metabolism. The way to cure the disease in modern terms is to try to actually replace the beta cell uh, in the body. We went back to look at the science of the problem, how beta cells begin and what allows them to become functional. And we believe that there was a missing link. For us, the missing link begins in the genome. That's where the key genes that are involved in insulin control reside. A factor called ER gamma, that's the transcription factor that we identified, actually controls that switch, that metabolic switch, that normally occurs at the beginning of life. So when we put that switch into uh, beta-like cells into these partially functional beta cells, we actually found they then become fully functional. And when they become fully functional, then we could transplant them into animals and see the immediate drop in glucose. What we actually did is insert the switch back into the non-functional cell, introduce it in a way that we could actually turn it on, and when we flipped that switch, the cells now become responsive to glucose and release human insulin. We are hoping that these human cells could be transplanted back into a patient to provide a treatment for diabetes. We are excited about the finding because now we are able to do human disease modeling and drug screening for diabetes. Firstly, we rescued mice with actual human cells producing human insulin. While we have a prototype human cell, we can actually make customized human cells from the actual individuals themselves uh, who have diabetes. So this would be personal medicine where you take cells from the actual diabetic patient. We can convert them into functional beta cells in a dish, then transplant these cells back into the patient. The idea of rescuing patients with their own cells is the ultimate type of therapy because you do not have to worry about immune rejection or the challenges of putting other tissue back into the body.